I have no idea. It's a mystery to everyone, Riggs. An eternity of futile struggle or penance for my unspeakable Week transgressions. Week 80. Yeah, no problem. So that's what we were just doing to unlock the um, the champion crew. Uh, I might actually take R squared to this. Double Hyman is really good. Um, but the problem with Double Hyman is that we die, don't have uh, any kind of stall ability on the way there to heal up. So I might, might take R squared. Uh, anyone that can hit really hard on a single target is good against the crew because you can free people faster from um, uh, from the heave ho move or whatever. And R squared has a lot of damage output. And he can hit all the way from back in position three. So probably a good one to take. Uh, Shady. Shady, they really get sub. Who'd you hit? Uh, po Pooter? Pooter for two months. <laughs> Thank you, Shady. Your axe is ready. You got uh, all that, like, facial reconstruction done from that crit tree branch smack. Have you gone to a dungeon since you got critically hit with that tree branch smack down to the face? I don't I don't think you have, have you? Did <laughs> random me? I think you, Shady. So I might take you. Um, I like Double Highwind better. It's better for killing the boss, but uh, it's not good in Champion Cove because of the uh, the crab. So I probably will take you. Uh, and then we want our Occultist. Evasive Beast Hater is good. Thick-Blooded Tough is good. We're probably going to just take Ixum again because of the dodge. Um, and then we will take, take Woozy. Woozy's just going everywhere. And then I still will take a Highwoman, I believe. Uh, Muzz, let's see. Yumi has the damage. Captain Kane has the defense. I think I'm going to go with the damage this time. Full party white to the Shrieker. Broke his brain how much he was getting crit for. Oh, yeah. Critical. I was talking about when we fought the... We cheesed the Shrieker. But uh, a bit, if you want to call it cheese, we just... Uh, we dodge stacked Houndmasters and just had them keep guarding for ludicrous amounts of dodge. But um, crit peck is a really hard-hitting move. Absolutely have had people die from getting critically hit by Peck. Alright. Uh, I think this is going to be okay. Have you considered a leper? Yeah, well, here's the th other thing about it, Vol. What's the leper going to do when someone gets pulled... Two people get pulled in front of him and he's in position three and you need to break the anchor? What's he going to do then? Is he going to walk forward... <laughs> while the boss heals itself and the person in the front gets stressed. That'll help us. The crew is just shaking in their little boat. Oh no, the leper's walking towards us. <laughs> uh, all right. No, I'm not taking a leper to this. Worst kind of party wipe is a chain heart attack. Uh, all right, Ixum, we're going to stack the most dodge on you, most likely. Uh, we also want Wilbur's flag for the stun resist. Woozy. Might come as a shock, Woozy, but you're also taking dodge. Uh, R squared, we're going to go damage. So we might go candle because he will get some dodge off of it and uh, damage. Sure, in there a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> That's a good quote. Thank you. Oh, you wouldn't even quote it. That was just you typing it. I thought you retyped it to quote it. Um, let's see. With Yumi, probably gonna do Ancestor's Pin. Uh, he already has a Risk Taker, so they're not gonna be dodging much anyway. This will be fun. You can though. Yeah, thank you. So R squared has rabies, which is a problem. He's gonna be fine after. You know what? I'll just take the focus ring. Uh, he'll be fine 
after the first turn, but on the first turn, it's going to be pretty scary. Pretty scary. Yeah, that should be fine, actually. All right. Pointing an acorn at me. <laughs> Friendly, they take out context. Anything that you want to remember me saying? Pretty much. They don't all have to be some kind of innuendo or something. <laughs> no. Although most of them are. I don't really like this team going to the boss, but it's good for the boss, so. Let's go, Mizuma. Welcome in. Um. All right, should be good. Welcome back. Your steadfast loyalty is greatly appreciated. Uh, Rwanti. Hey, Rwanti, it's good to see you. 35 months? It's you. Actually, catch the stream. Hey, Rwanti, I was wondering about you. You're all alive. Hey, everyone, Rwanti's alive. Thank you for the reset, Rwanti. Hope you've been well. The good news is now I know to thrust this guy up here. Not you. I'm going to thrust your friend, though. You get the backstab. Why, hello there. It's thrusting time. <laughs> uh, there's nothing wrong with that quote. I can't imagine anyone misconstruing that as anything other than uh, thrusting a sword. You will join us or die. I think master. we're good. We have. This is how we do it. Uh, maybe I take plan takedown for this. Let's see, we're going to do Unparalleled Finesse, that's four points. We're going to do Tiger's Eye, that's three, so we're up at seven. Um, eight and nine. Yeah, that goes over by one. I could use that in place of uh, Tiger's Eye, though. I don't think I want to. No, I think we're fine. All right, let's go. Second to last champion boss out of the normal dungeons. It's a hype train. Which button is that? All aboard the hype train. All right, let's go over prepared. We've been busy doing stuff. Suspicious. Uh, we're going over prepared to this because we're rich. So. That's fun stuff to mess with me about. Yeah. All the food. Shovels, uh, we have all the stuff for crabs and the boss and whatever else might befall us during this dungeon. Uh, upgrades, damage trinkets, skills. Camping, upgrades, dodge trinkets, skills, camping. Upgrades, dodge trinkets, skills, camping. Upgrades, damage trinkets. Skills camping. All right. A lot of times I underestimate the champion uh, crew. It, uh, they actually can cause a lot of stress. I've had a lot of people get afflicted on champion crew. All right, let's go. Bot sentience. While the greedy dogs slept off their revelry, I oh, hexed yes. their anchor with every twisted incantation yeah, I could muster, that That's awesome. imbuing it with the weight of my ambition. Glad you're all right and my contempt for their crude extortion. At the witching hour, the anchor pulled with preternatural force, dragging craft and crew down into the Going depths. Tea, welcome back. They must have cried out, but no sound <laughs> escaped the swirling black waters. Mizuma, thank you for the gift sub to Mediocre Mark. Thank you, Mizuma. Uh, much love to Mizuma as well, or Wanti and Mizuma. The Thanks. poor devils. It crashed your browser. <laughs> and drowning for eternity. So they're they're down there. Kind of a long uh long way to them. No fights in the first two hallways or first two rooms. I'll take that. We're not gonna loot on the way there, pretty much. Um We're only here to kill the boss. Like loot is very much secondary. Ghoul will eventually finish the memory leak. What is going there's no fights in the dungeon? Don't worry, guys. 
Voice line, the opening of this boss fight is your favorite, really? Yeah, that's exactly what happened in the last dungeon. I was like, we're not here for loot. And on the very first scout, we found a secret room. Back deep in a game dev animation project. Yeah, that's awesome. Yeah. Uh, it is good to see you. You will join us or die, sub alive, though. Master. Uh, I, I have no idea who does that, you know? It doesn't tell me unless you do the shares, so. Mizuma, thank you for another gift sub. Who'd you hit to T? Uh, T, welcome to the sub club. Now you can use all these awesome emotes anywhere on Twitch. No more ads here for you. Match is struck. A blazing star you, is born. A blazing star. Yeah, there's no fights in this dungeon. We're fine. Uh oh. Here's one. Just kidding. The blood quickens. It's the pinchy bottom boy. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. Alright. Well, I didn't use any holy waters. We'll see what happens. Ah, nice. That was really nice, actually. Oh, and then we got crit immediately. Hey, we resisted. <laughs> like you resist. I was, about to, I was about to comment on how big of a bleed that actually is. Uh, apparently, no bleed at all. Don't you worry. <laughs> Two to four, half a crit. Uh, I'm gonna go for the uh, stun here. It's the toaster boy. <laughs> Band, it's just everyone's resisting again. Confidence surges as the Poor enemy crab. Comes. With his double toaster tragedy. Crabs are people, justice for crabs. Crab people, crab people. The fortifying herb in his hands. <laughs> yeah, Wayne, blazing star. <laughs> Precision and power. Toast crab, toast crab, toast whatever he wants to toast. Dee -dee 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 -dee. Look out, it's toast crab. That's right. I don't want to uh, destroy a corpse, but I shouldn't. You know how much crab is in there? I mean, I don't know that I would eat it. I probably would. That's a lot of crab meat. That's crazy. Crazy min amounts. Uh, immense. Immense amounts. Crazy crab meat. Another crit from Arterial Pinch? Okay, so now we have 50 bleed on us. That's what I was going to comment on before. 50 bleed is a pretty high number. I mean, it's a 10 point bleed, but over the life of it, it's 50. Uh, yeah, we might as well just kill him. Crown a loaf of bread. Perhaps Put his fences around point. your head. Look out, here comes the toaster crown. <laughs> Good song. I like his theme song. Leave the state for gold with the amount. There's another secret room. Amount of crab meat. It's probably worth more. So, <laughs> Abby, welcome back. How's the run coming through? Uh, pretty well. We're about to do uh the final. No, no, second to last champion boss. May we find victory? I mean, we we've already thrown down trapezohedrons today. That's how rich we are. In the last dungeon, we threw down like thirty thousand gold or some ridiculousness. We so rich. We have like a half million back at home. All right, uh, we're gonna go this way. Less fights. It feels so weird to not get trapezohedron. It's like, yeah, it's just there's the instead of there being a trail of breadcrumbs leading back to the hamlet, for us it's it's like rubies, just gemstones of all sorts. It looks like Adam's team came this way. How can you tell? There's a line of gemstones. Well 
Shield struck. Free boost for everyone in Hamlet. He will join us or Let's die. Let's see what he brings another gift stuff. This time to it. Semi Salty Squid for the second month. Hey, Mizuma. If anyone didn't see, by the way, Squid made me some awesome uh, Stardew artwork. I have a art page up now. Uh, AdamRiversEverything.com slash arts. If you haven't seen it, it's pretty awesome. It's pretty awesome. Goal already. Uh, thank you, Mizuma. As the fiend falls, a faint hope. Abby's art is on there as well. Oh, no. What have you done? I thought you would kill him. Uh oh, you have to keep jute tapestries, though. It's the rule. All aboard the hype train. We all face problems. This one has chosen to embrace them. You've embraced your problems, Keith. Thank you. <laughs> uh, Keith, thank you for the continuation. You converted Twitch Prime into a tier one sub. Them. Thank you, Keith. Appreciate that as well. Uh, I kind of want to get another heal in, but now nah, we don't need to. Press this advantage. Hello. Give them no quarter. Why are you stroking your beard? Be wary. Triumphant pride precipitates a dizzying fall. Hang on, my wife showed me something very important. Wow. They're starting to make Winnie the Pooh uh, Legos, so it was very important. <laughs> um, this might seem weird, but I'm going back the other way. Because here we can camp directly before the boss to make sure we go to the boss in the best shape possible. Whereas if that's a bad battle, I mean, I guess I could just take the battle and then backtrack and it would be. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it that way. That's the least likely to screw us over. So we are going to. Um... Oh, man, he got the. He got the damage buff instead of the stress heal. So we're going to lose that 20%. That sucks. I should have just camped. Oh, well. Yeah, I'm going to I'm gonna take this battle. Carl! Battle, Carl. Uh, we don't want to get rid of anything. Sorry, Carl. We'll leave you in your natural habitat. What'd you say? Hand? Okay. The ground quakes. Got an interesting morning. I would stay in his natural habitat. It's fine. More secrets. It's just the same secret again. How's it going, Pilot Wash? Welcome in. Annihilated. Annihilated. Yeah, I wish I had uh, not taken that curio, though. The chance of getting the, um, As the damage mount, so actually seems resistance. relatively rare compared to the other one. I don't know what the percentages are on them. Um, so I took it trying to get the stress relief off the bounty hunter, but I mean, that's kind of wasn't really needed that much either. Which curio? It's the figurehead one, the ship mask, whatever. I forget what it's actually called. But yeah, it can give 20% of da damage boost, but it seems mo uh, more common. Um, yeah, in the plus four speed. It seems more common for it to actually do the stress heal, but oh well. Shouldn't have risked it. We'll be fine. Um, we already have the tr stuff that we want, so. 
We're just here to kill the boss, the so we're going to the feast. Yet be won. Uh, we want unparalleled finesse. This is how we do it. And tiger's eye. Uh, we can also use dark strings. Let's put dark strength on um, Hyman, actually. No ambush, the good. Is lit. The path is All right, clear. and we didn't spawn any uh, hall battles going back in here. So, board. let's go do the boss. Let's go, Young. Welcome in. Collect bounty, we want. Uh, finish him, we want. Flashbang, we... They they made it. You usually can be able to cheese this fight, and they, they fixed it. Uh, there were several ways where you can move the crew in front of the anchor, and then it just couldn't do anything. Anchor couldn't latch onto you, and so you just keep moving the crew in front of it. And completely undo all the mechanics of the fight. Uh, this is all fine. This is fine, too. It's good. All right. We are good to go. Even in death, the captain shouts his orders, and the crew. Magli, you think it's it is immune now, basically. Uh, used to, I think, what it was is that the crew itself wasn't really immune to movement, and you could pull the crew in front. Um, like it was an oversight by Red Hook, I think, is they made it so the anchor itself couldn't move but you can move things in front of it so uh i kind of don't want to use finale right now so i'm actually just going to move them back good start seriously fluster clucks your way through it every time <laughs> masterfully executed dead. Alright, he went after our highest dodge target. It's good for us. Big damage. So challenge runs, have you thought of adding mods? Some great classes and enemies. Uh, yeah, we've done full modded playthroughs a couple times, but we kind of go against the kind of fun challenge that we're doing it right now because it would completely mitigate um, the class restriction of not having certain types of abilities. But yeah, I, I played all the way through Pitchlight Dungeon. We did Pitchlight Dungeon Torchless uh, back in like 2018. We've done all modded class runs before. So yeah, I'm not against mods, just talk while you drown. I say, hey, Yumi has got you. You're fine. Don't even worry about it. Man, they really like you, I squid. Well, I'm not even using the holy water, I gotta. Gotta rectify that. A decisive pummeling. Ooh, we even got a dodge there. That play is modded. No, unfortunately, the last time I did modded runs, I didn't really have the foresight at the time to um, to save all my vods and stuff, and I didn't have a YouTube channel at the time, so I wouldn't mind doing a new modded playthrough at some point, just because I don't have any. Um, left recording any vod save from it a devastating blow is the crew captain hiring tell him you're on linkedin <laughs> uh he's not long for this world so i don't i don't think he's hired anyone yeah keep going after ixon perfect you've made a mistake drown anchorman man we still have 46 dodge on him even after finale Come on, when do you two go next, please? Oh, that sucks. Impressive. That sucks. Turn order kind of screws us over. Wraith or sisters? Yeah, I really like the sisters too. Um, in general, though, I, I don't know. Yeah, sisters are a really good one. I don't know if they're my favorite or not.
would be great. Well, yeah, like I said, I have nothing against them, but for this specific challenge, the only real part of the challenge is the fact that I can only use the base male characters. I mean, we're doing Blood Moon, All Boss, blah, 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 all that kind of stuff. Hardest you can do the base game, but with the restrictions of only using male characters from the original roster, so therefore, you know, using additional classes would seem to kind of go against that. All right, there was the crew. Champion crew done. GG. Fitting. You like the eight pounder and all variants really boring. Yeah, yeah. I've talked about that a lot too. There's so many things they could have done with the second wheel boss, and it seems kind of uh, crap in general because there's already a, a bandit, like brigand type enemy uh, with Wolf. So it's like really strange that they decided to also um, have the cannon. They could have done a giant spider or some other giant creature, like a giant diseased bear. They could have done like the tree in the background that has all the hands tied to it. All those would have been pretty cool. And they could have made the cannon part of like the vault dungeon or something. And purpose is made clear. Bloody mushroom boss. Yeah, there's all kinds of different options. I don't know why they went with a cannon for there. I mean, I know like the lore they came up with around it, but it seems like it would fit with the wolf. Because uh, the other one was downstairs and I didn't want to go down and get it. So. All right, a couple of uh, really good modders. Yeah. Uh, both Claire and Marvin Sayo are in the credits for Color of Madness. Circus too, maybe. Eradicated. Playthroughs from other creators don't look like Darkest Dungeon. Oh, yeah. yeah. I gotcha. Being beaten with an invisible noodle. It's invisible for me, though. Spot, yeah. Forty-seven. Forty-seven. Yeah, like I said, it's been a while since I did a modded playthrough, so I wouldn't mind doing one again at some point. Just I have another run planned after this one. Uh, maybe after that. The run's going too well. Beat me up. Inspiration and improvement. Everyone in the Steam Workshop <laughs> needs to go. Yeah. I mean, not everyone, but yeah, a lot of them. There are some really good class mods, though. Um, really well done. Like Marvin Sayos, for instance, are, are some of the better ones. Um, I really think the Falconer feels like she could just be in the game. Like she, I, I've always said that I would like a dedicated like bow class, not crossbow, like a true uh, bow and arrow type class. And she uh, would be heard for that. Darkness Both iterations. Men. An Adam skin <laughs> for Most a mod. Creatures can uh, Tactical felt, Fatty made can one for the beaten. Crusader to where when it holds up the banner, it has one of my emotes on it. Um, but as far as like a whole skin, no, no one's done anything like that. Uh, so we don't need gold at all. Suncloak, am I going to use that sometime? I'm going to go with no. But either way. This time we'll get the stress relief. Falconer is a worse Arbalist? Um... Well, there's been different iterations of the Falconer, too, I guess is the thing. The light. So the original Cross Falconer, and then they changed it to be uh, like a stance, dance class. I don't know if Marvin was like, you know what? I really like how the sisters are, so I'm going to make the Falconer more similar to them. But I don't know. I like her better than the Orbalist. I really don't want a disease where we head out of here. Uh, also, we might as well use their holy water. 
kind of tie, maybe. That'd be crazy. But yeah, uh, as like I said before, no obligation to ever do more stuff, Abby. I really appreciate the art that you've done so far, though. It's been really awesome. I share it anytime I can. Like, is there are moon moon skins. Yeah, I know there's a whole set for Baru as well. After conquering the game, what keeps me coming back? Two things. First off, it's my job, basically. So, that helps. I doubt I would have 2,500 hours in the game if it wasn't for the fact that I get paid to play the game. <laughs> uh, second is just more challenges, more fun challenges to do. So, it's a fun job, but it's still a job, you know? So that mainly, I would say. Can leave it a lurk. <laughs> One of the people I didn't use holy water on, of course. Uh, that's fine though. It's probably yeah, it's the last fight. Uh, we got a hunger proc in this hallway. So, and then we're going to go in the secret room. Wait, I don't even need the secret room, though. So, I don't know. Nice. nice. Uh, I didn't think he was going to kill him that round, or else I would have snuffed the torch sooner. Success so clearly in uh... If we don't go in the secret room because we don't need the gold, which is crazy, we actually can survive uh, one more hallway. So we could make it all the way to the heirloom chest, and heirlooms are way more important to us. So I'm going to skip that secret room entirely. Uh, there is a chance that we run into Shambler in this next hallway. So I guess... Yeah, should be all right. Another Carl. Carl. I don't need you, Carl. I'm sorry. Okay, no hall battle. We're good. A fortune. Is what a first? Spent. Secret door. Is there a chance you can open the room just by clicking on the map? No, there's nuts. There's only two secret rooms you can do that to in the game tribe. One is in Wolf's um, quest dungeon. And that one is... Um, uh, that one's just a normal heirloom chest. And the other one is in uh, the final Darkest Dungeon quest. And that one uh, just has the lore in it, or a note from the developers, I should say. Yeah, I'm actually doing the not here for the loot, yeah. Save me some clicks, yeah. You have to get a critical scout through the hallway. Long dungeons will always have a secret room, but you have to get a critical scout through the hallway to find it. Uh, medium dungeons have a 50% chance of a secret room. And then short dungeons will never have a secret room. All right. 